I am Soon Chang Jing, daughter of Soon Jiang. Growing up, I studied the martial arts right alongside my brothers. That surprises most people, but I'm very proud of my skill. These days, wars are breaking out all over the land. It's a tough time to live in, but it's also the perfect time for me to prove myself. I'm not just going to stay home anymore while my father and brothers go off to fight. They raised me like a warrior, and that's exactly what I'm going to be. Shang Zhang, you did an excellent job of guarding the home front. As you know, we scored a great victory at Sishui Gate and disposed of the tyrant Dong Zhuo in Luoyang. But now, the once unified coalition has split in all directions. Yuan Shu has entered into a struggle with Liu Biao of Jing and is requesting our assistance, Shang Zhang. Though I have agreed with your wishes to attend this battle, promise me you'll play it safe. First, lead the army in from the east and attack the enemy where their defenses are weak. an attack from the west. Say, you take the main gate. Shang Zhang, you take the east. A defense base. Get ready. It won't go down easily. Sun Jian, what business do you have bringing your family here? You should go back to hunting along the Jiangdong. Silence! I will not listen to Liu Biao's lapdog. I claim this land of Jing in the name of the Sun family. There's no escaping me, Huang Zhu. Did you think you could overcome this base? Okay, show them what we got. An attack base. Destroy it before it causes more damage. A supply base, huh? Tear it down! That'll show them! Just because we're a supply base doesn't mean we can't fight! You've walked right into my trap, you half-wit! Badly injured. I have to withdraw. My children, the fate of our family is in your hands. Liu Biao, you'll pay for what you've done. <laughs> Sun Jian has fled. Prepare to attack.
Pisp. Ah. We mustn't lose focus. It'll be okay. Wait for me, father. I will kill Liu Biao for you. Show them the strength of our forces! Come! Hit me with everything you got! Exceptional skill. I'm not gonna die here. Time to run. So you must be looking for trouble. I faced a worthy opponent. Who says a woman has to be weak? It's just like when we were kids. We shall push them back. for trouble. shall not go unpunched. Here I go! I won't be denied next time. Who says a woman has to be weak? Enforcements are here! Launch the attack at once! We shall push them back!
should be over shortly. Know who you're dealing with. So, my might was not enough. Who says a woman has to be weak? out that punk Yu Biao and captured Jing. That ought to teach those across the land not to mess with us. My beloved father was fatally wounded in a battle with Liu Biao. And just as I was about to finally put it behind me, my brother Sei also passed away from this world. Luckily, my brother Quan was able to overcome his grief and become the next to lead our family. He joined forces with Liu Bei and defeated Cao Cao's fleet at Chibi. Now, it's time to head for the battlefield again. I wonder who this Liu Bei is that is fighting alongside us. I hope I get the chance to meet him. Our alliance sank the gigantic navy of cow cows to the depths of the Changjiang. Now we just need to chase down Cao Cao and realize total victory. With his army on the brink of elimination, Cao Cao is using what protection he has left to escape from Chi Bi. We must not let him get away from us. Princess, we must smash Cao Cao and his ambitions along with him. It is time to welcome the dawn of Wu that Sun Jian and Sun Se dreamed about. We must go and realize their dreams with our strength. Is this where my struggle finally ends? Guan Yu, was my fate decided from the very moment that you left me? Go. It is still not possible for me to forget my debt to you. But that debt ends here. The next time you oppose my lord, I will kill you. Remember that, Lord Cao Cao. Lord Cao Cao, I believe my debt to you is paid. Don't let Cao Cao get away! I'll take out the bridge before the enemy shows up. Master is here? Quick, cut open a path! We're not going to get anywhere at this rate. Attack 
walking alone? Have you lost your mind? I shall return before this is all over. Who says a woman has to be weak? Some battles you win, and some battles you lose. Who says a woman has to be weak? I won't be denied next time. Who says a woman has to be weak? This should be easy enough. You stand in my way. I shall show no mercy. I won't lose a second time. Who says a woman has to be weak? I would rather live and redeem myself than die in shame. Who says a woman has to be weak? So, you are Sun Chang Zhang. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance. I am... Um, can we skip all the formalities? Glad to meet you, Lord Liu Bei. Okay, let us fight together, Shang Zhang. Cow, this way! You have my thanks! My chance to show what I am made of. Excellent work, Shang Shang. I have to try harder. Master, where are you, Master? Retreat is an acceptable strategy. Who says a woman has to be weak? I won't lose a second time. Who says a woman has to be weak? I'm not going to get anywhere at this rate. Finally made it! Alone? I hope you're ready. Who the heck 
could he be? Excellent work, Shang Chen. I have to try harder. To get anywhere at this rate. A proper strategy is always with strength. Retreat is an acceptable strategy. Who says a woman has to be weak? Now is my chance to show what I am made of! Denied next time. Who says a woman has to be weak? Someday you shall pay for this. Who says a woman has to be weak? We have thoroughly crushed Cow Cow's army. It was quite humorous to see them scattering about like ants. This defeat should shut him up for a while. However, he will definitely come seeking revenge. Before that time comes, we must build up our military strength and be prepared to meet their advance. And you but this After the battle at Chibi, my marriage was arranged to Liu Bei. He was a big help in saving us from the invasion by Cao Cao. I'm sure he and I would get along great together. However, just after I left to go to him, I was suddenly called back home. Then it occurred to me. I was being used in a plot against Liu Bei. I hope you can forgive me, Liu Bei. I really did have true feelings for you. I hope we can still meet again. I Princess, forgive me. But marriages for a highborn lady such as you are made for political gain. So with the current turmoil, please understand our Lord's reasons for calling you back. We will hereby invade the territory of Heifei, where Wei has stationed their forces. If we can obtain these lands, it will prove most beneficial in our struggle against Wei. Currently, the enemy is few and their defenses are thin. However, those who remain are veterans of many hard-fought battles. You must not underestimate the strength of their resolve. Don't look so down, Ling Tong. In this battle, we have the advantage. We are attacking Wei at Shu's request? Why must we help them? But, for our sake as well, we must capture Hei Fei and stop Wei's march south! Gan Ning, you are the key to this battle. Got it? Right! Leave it to me! <laughs> are you sure your ship can carry the weight of your thick skull? In the advance. Their numbers are few. Wipe them all out. Finish them off. Just because.
because we're a supply base doesn't mean we can't fight. soon. It's time to see what you are made of. That's my sister. For strength, we'll have to wait. Who says a woman has to be weak? I'm sorry you have to face us in battle. Show no mercy. I won't be denied next time. Who says a woman has to be weak? Forward for honor! With my spear, I will sever the threads of Wu's destiny! Let's see how you like my power. It's an ambush! Turn back and rebuild the camp! Sometimes unavoidable. Who says a woman has to be weak? Don't you think you're being a little arrogant, Zhang Liao? You're no match for the strength and skill of Zhang Liao. The enemy is collapsing before us. You stand in my way. I shall show no mercy. But 
gonna take a little extra to get this one. The tides of battle have shifted in our favor. We can do better than that. I would rather live and redeem myself than die in shame. Better head back. I have to protect my master and all. Did you think you could overcome this base? We made it! Just because we're a supply base doesn't mean we can't fight. Without the bridge. Father, brother, lend strength to my ambition. I won't be denied next time. Who says a woman has to be weak? I'm sorry to have to face us in battle. Just because we're a supply base doesn't mean we can't fight. chance to win this. I must retreat. For now. Who says a woman has to be weak? I shall teach you about that. Jen Liao has returned! Retreat is an acceptable strategy. Who says a woman has to be weak? Here I go! Someday, you shall pay for this. Says a woman has to be weak. We have gained the right to rule this land. Although we were unable to kill Cow Cow, should we use this momentum to crush Cow Cow? Or perhaps we should break our alliance and attack the Bay. Or perhaps. <laughs> We won the battle at Heifei. It was then decided that we should subdue the barbarian King Meng Huo in the south. Another battle, but I feel a little relieved. At least tensions have subsided with Shu, so we won't be fighting against Liu Bei for a while. Meng Huo's barbarians are set to share a strong sense of unity, but no one's as unified as we are here in Wu. There'll be no match for the Soon family's strength.
Due to the heavy damage we inflicted on Wei at the Battle of Heifei, the land has come to know a moment's peace. We must use this to our advantage and wipe out our enemies in the south. The enemy is centered around their king, Meng Huo, and they all appear to be like one big family. This unity cannot be underestimated. This battle could very well prove to be difficult. But it is as you say. The bonds between the Sun family of Wu cannot be matched in strength. Okay, let us head for the southern continent. Forward! Run them down and take control! If they're so eager to die, then we'll be happy to fight! It's about time I faced a worthy opponent. Who says a woman has to be weak? It'll take more than just you to stop me. It's about time I faced a worthy opponent. Who says a woman has to be weak? Guys, play a little defense. I see you have a little heat of your own. Who says a woman has to be weak?
open! What? I didn't expect to run into the enemy here. It'll take more than just you to stop me. It's about time I face the worthy opponent. Did you think you could overcome this face? Impressive. The king never loses a fight! defeated the Nanmon king, Meng Huo, and secured the lands of Nanmon. The resources here shall increase the strength of Wu tremendously. We no longer need fear of being attacked from behind. A new this body Settled the southern lands, so we will soon renew our conflicts with Xu and Wei. Once again, I will be forced to fight against my dear Liu Bei. Liu Bei has declared war on us over the death of his brother Guan Yu. I understand the anger and pain he must feel, for I too have lost members of my family. We have no choice but to fight. I wish I didn't have to face Liu Bei, but no matter how I feel about him, my family will always come first. Shu has declared this a battle to avenge the death of Guan Yu and has dispatched their army to Yi Ling. However, Shu is without honor, so they have no chance of victory. The flames of our passion shall put an end to them. I am having Zhu Ran prepare the fire attack. We shall wait for an opportunity to set up a bridge layer to set fire to the enemy camp. Until then, we must wait and concentrate on our defenses. <laughs> <laughs> 
Princess, I understand your feelings, but Liu Bei has given in to his hatred and lost his way. For the good of Wu, you must fight against me. I mean Shu. Lu Xun will take command of this battle. Zhu Ron will need time to prepare the fire attack. We must do everything we can to hold the enemy at bay. Guan must pay for the death of Guan Yu. My final battle. Send out the second wave. Just because we're a supply base doesn't mean we can't fight. than just you to stop me. over already. Who says a woman has to be weak? Look sharp, everyone. Forward, march. Damn! It's 
over already. Who says a woman has to be weak? It's almost ready! Keep holding! Do you think you can stop me? Ready. Now, Jiran must spread the flames. is not without skill. The attack is ready! Fire! Now it begins! These fires shall light the road to victory in this battle! It worked! All we need now is to charge the enemy! Get out of this maze and retreat! Such impressive skill! I could learn something from you! So this is to be my final battle! Who says a woman has to be weak? Crush them in an instant. This is odd, but don't hold back. Keep moving. So you must be looking for trouble.
Zhuge Liang is on his way. Hold on till he arrives. We've defeated your trap. Prepare yourself, Liu Bei. Liu Bei, I truly believed that we could have started a new life together. But Shang Zhang... Stay back! I am a daughter of the Sun family. And I am loyal to my father, my brother, and to Wu. Shang Zhang, I guess it is up to me to stop you. Shang Zhang, restrain yourself! <laughs> on anger is doomed to fail. If you live by your emotions, then you shall die by your emotions. It truly is a fitting end for Liu Bei. Thanks to this battle, we managed to increase our power while rendering Shu harmless. All that remains is Wei, who is of no real threat to us. The day of a land ruled by Wu is close at hand. A new body, this bodyguard. It was during the final days of the year 200 AD when the Han Dynasty saw its end. Its demise ushered in a new era of chaos, brought on by several regional lords vying to rule China. There were those who sought absolute power, as well as those who fought for justice, and some simply fought for the sake of their beliefs. Many would rise and fall in their attempts to dominate the land. Sun Shang Zheng, born in the Wu territory, the daughter of Sun Jian, she was very fond of the martial arts from a young age, always carrying a bow at her waist. After Dong Zhuo's defeat, the land would be thrown into chaos once again. The Sun family began to build their forces with the intention to rule the land. Sun Shang Zhang was said to have fought just as well as any man on the battlefield. Wu's victory over Cao Cao at Qi Bi had expanded their power tremendously. However, there was still Liu Bei's empire, which could not be left unchecked. The decision was made to form a truce with Liu Bei by wedding Sun Shang Zhang to him. After some time, Sun Shang Zhang actually fell in love with Liu Bei. However, since the marriage was conducted as a mere ploy, she was called back by her brother to return to Wu. Keeping her true feelings for Liu Bei a secret, she left Shu. With Sun Shang Zhang back, Wu was once again a formidable force, advancing south and taking control of Nanjiang. Additionally, Guan Yu was slain in Jing, 
Angered by the loss of his sworn brother, Liu Bei fought his way east and was eventually killed at Yiling. Sun Shang Zhang and Liu Bei were torn from one another by the fighting. She hated the chaos and swore to live on with Liu Bei in her heart. Her fighting will not stop until all the people become truly happy. These tales, long forgotten in the flows of time, are about the legends of which no one can recall. I shall live a life worthy of your memory. <laughs> <laughs> 